24 slots now that Ace that can't be stopped. I can't believe it. This is it. This is our guy. And it's not it's not silly looking either. I like the little leather straps. What is up the world? It is your friendly neighborhood slip gator here hanging out today doing stuff and things playing some more no man's sky peeps Hope you guys are having a good day. I'm having a great day and we're back no man's sky in Thanks so much for coming to hang out with me Make sure if you liked what you see today Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and ensure you support peeps And if you're new and you haven't already don't forget to subscribe as well. What are you green sponge ball carbon? I love some of that. Are you gonna get mad at me stupid? Where's the stupid guy? So I decided to come over, we're on a new planet, and um, I saw this thing, and I was like, I don't even understand what this is. I don't know what it is. It's just some sort of new build. Oh, well, there's mean guys around. Oh, ha, 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 the chance to kill. That's what I like to hear. Where are you at, mean guy? Will you see this? Oh, there it is. You want some? You want some, crab? Oh, my God, this crab is not easy. Okay, get killed, crab. I thought it'd just die right quite real quick. Something like that. But anyway... Oh, what the crap is that thing? Oh my god. It looks like something you'd like as a pet. Just way, way too big. So anyway, today, as you can see from the title of the video, I think we're going to look... What the crap? This is so cute. You're so cute. Oh, let's feed it. Be my friend, man. What's up, friend thing? Oh, man. I don't know about you. Okay, go do your thing. This planet also looks really interesting it looks like a lot of the other planets but some of the caves here just kind of look neat but all right so we're in our new super pink flamingo we're looking for multi-tool stuff and things the first thing that we're going to do is come over to this beacon uh this not beacon but the signal scanner and we've got to go ahead and craft up a uh one of those deals what come on game why do you hate me man all right there we go bypass chip so we're going to grab our bypass chip we're going to go ahead and inside of here we're going to do a scan and we're looking for beacons all right so let's go ahead and go for, or we're looking for transmissions, pardon me. So if we go for transmissions, it should search, and we're trying to find beacons. That's going to lead us. The beacon hopefully will lead us to a couple of different things. Well, we got a transmission tower. That's not what we want. So we might have to do a couple of different ones. Um, but yeah, once we can find a beacon, hopefully we can find a beacon. That'll take us to the next stage in our journey. So, my gosh, I don't know what's going on with this thing. There we go. Let's just make a couple of these guys. Like so. We'll search again. Fingers crossed. Beacons are what we want. Because what we're trying to find is intelligent life forms. There's a couple of different ways to do this, actually. So first thing we're going to try to do is do this and see if we can't find a beacon. Observe. Ob uh, yeah. Uh, it's an observatory. That's not what we want. We want a beacon. Hey, game. You know what? I don't know if you understand this, uh, Signal Scanner, but I'm a YouTuber. I'm trying to make a video. And I'm trying to show everybody what's going on. And you're just ruining it for everybody. Are you going to find me a beacon this time? Because I'm going to be a little bit irked if you don't great this game is great i love it it's so great right now so anyway if you can find a beacon which i'm going to continue to search for it'll lead you to the next stage so i'm probably just going to do this a million times uh, uh in a second here and find one um the other thing that i've been working on is just getting uh, into some uh warp cells because we don't have any so i've been crafting up some stuff and things rod of heridium and zinc as well seriously well we have enough to get one warp cell going so let's head over to here is our ship close enough for us to refill no not at all. All right. So we're, we're 0 for 2 over here so far. Look at, what is this? Oh, it's just another deal. So we got to find some heridium and zinc too. Probably readily available on the planet. Find a beacon and make our way to the next stage of super multi-tuality. So right now, what do we got for how many slots do we have? We got a 16 slots. The maximum slot. Hello. The maximum slots that we can get is 24 slots. So that's what we're looking for. So, I'm going to bring the ship down a little bit closer. I might just fly around, too, to see so I can show you what we're looking for. We can actually just fly around. You know those um, there's little deals around here that have uh, landing pads, and there's just one landing pad? Not the buildings that have multiple landing pads, but the buildings that have a single landing pad. That's actually what we're trying to go for. So, you can actually just fly around and find it. It looks like some iridium right down there that I need. But, oh, is this one? The, the outpost on this planet looks so weird. No, that's an ob observatory. So, I'm going to continue to look around. Probably gather up a little bit of zinc. A little bit of heridium. What are you? Is that like a huge... If this is a huge zinc deal, I'll be super impressed. 
Aluminium. All right, so gathering up some more stuff and things, and I will be RBs, peeps. And we're back. So I decided to warp to the next Atlas interface, and this, if I'm not mistaken, is going to be our tenth. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and this Atlas stone is going to be our tenth. So I don't know if this is going to do something special or not. I know when you get supposedly i haven't actually seen this happen but when you get 10 atlas stones you're supposed to be able to birth a star which i mean I, I, i've never done that uh i would love to give birth to a star i would it would i guess it, it might be fun let's see what kind of stuff and things we get right here can't see anything already known all right so let's see this guy right here already known all right so let's see is this going to do anything special for us this time that's what i'm interested to see are you going to do a special thing, or are you just going to do the weird cryptic talk, and then nothing cool happens? The final interface is revealed. Oh, yeah. The Alice is beckoning. This is to total... What? Totality? This is conformity. I am elated, terrified, and broken. Every waypoint has inexorably drawn me here, and I have come so very far. The revelation tears me asunder. My role is complete. My program ended. Nothing is real. The existence is an imitation of life. A model made by jaded that doesn't make any sense this, this is a, you're not saying anything you're just saying stuff through the gateway lies the answer the only answer the embrace of truth is blah 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 okay so we got 10 alice stones so is it do we like wait what where did, oh, there it is right there okay it's like for a second there i didn't think it was there so can do we do it here or do we need to no i mean it's not something you can just build right I guess maybe this isn't it. All right, so we've got to continue. In order to birth a star, we've got to do more stuff and things. I'm going to walk around and touch a bunch of balls. Probably my second favorite thing to do. I'm going to also explore the solar system. Discover a bunch of the planets. Because we need to name planets after people. Some people who have been amazing followed on Twitter and left some kind comments. I'm going to do all that stuff. That'll be our bees, peeps. Oh, hello, ball. Hmm. Oh, hello, ball. Hmm. Are you going to show me where there's a beacon? Let's find out if this stupid thing will show me where there's a stupid beacon. Ruin my video. Signal scanner. Nope. Show me a beacon or it's over for you. I'll blow you up with my ship if you cannot show me where there's a freaking beacon. I hate you. I don't understand. Why do you hate me? Why do you hate your slip gator? Just want a beacon. That's all I want. It's very simple. All you need to do is use a signal scanner. Click for transmission, and then you'll just find a beacon. It's as easy as that. This is so easy. Finding a multi-tool is so easy. Probably won't show me a beacon, because that would just be too easy. Just want a beacon. Hey. OMG! Hey. It detected a beacon. It did its job. Unbelievable. This signal scanner, you saved yourself, buddy. I was going to blow you up, but you're fine. All right, so... The next stage in our journey is to go to the beacon. So let us travel over into this early type direction. It's right across the street here, so it shouldn't be too hard for us to find. It's a right here. All right, can we land right? Oh, we get a land in it. Ooh, can we get in there? Are we going to get in the hole? Oh, baby. Perfect landing. All right. Uh, wait, it might be on the edge a little bit. Now we'll use this, and we're looking for intelligent life. That's what we're trying to find here. So hopefully this will point us towards... Some sort of intelligent life form. Show me your amazing stuff and things, Beacon. Advanced life form detected. Nailed it, ACK, be stopped. So that's what we're trying to find. Now, we should be able to find a multi-tool at this spot. So, we'll head over into this early type direction. Where are you? Where was that advanced life form deal? And we're here. All right. So, this is what you're looking for. When you're looking for one of these guys, it's going to have a single landing bay area place like this if you don't nail the landing which i just happen to have stuck the landing you can build a bypass ship and you can call your starship with one of these guys right here now if we go inside of here we should right here see a multi-tool oh yeah baby that's what's up now let's check it out so here's the thing i want to check out so this is 15 slots how many slots do we have hold on how many slots do we currently have 16 slots so these multi-tools are going to be <clears throat> i do believe one higher or one lower than the one that you have now this one only has 15 so it's one lower now i have a little bit of a test i want to test so what i want to do is i'm going to go ahead i saved the game when i exited my ship 
So all you gotta do is to save your game, in case you guys don't know, most people who play this game probably know, is go like so, and it says restore point saved. Now, I ought to reload the game and see if it gives me the same multi-tool or a different one. Let's actually head right inside here, and let's look at it, so you can kind of see what it looks like, and then we'll cut back here in just a moment after I reloaded the game. And we're back at a new advanced life form station. I checked the old one a few times. I kept reloading the game, going back in and looking at the multi-tool, and it was the same multi-tool every time. The name was the same every time. So then I thought maybe it was because I went up to it and I opened it. Maybe it's because I opened it, and that's like the point at which it like generates the new multi-tool. And so I came to this new one and I found this guy, the final arc five. So this is an 18-slot multi-tool. So but before I even went to open this, right when I first got out of my ship, before I ever even went in here, obviously it saved the game. So then I went in and I opened it, and then I promptly closed the game and then reopened it and came over again, and it's exactly the same. So I don't think reloading the game, I don't know, I might be doing it wrong, or maybe I'm not doing it enough times, but this is a new 18 slot multi-tool, and we're gonna switch it over. I don't think reloading actually works for us. So we're gonna go ahead and Tear down this bad boy. And this multi-tool... Whoa, 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 whoa. This multi-tool is two slots better. Because it is an 18 slot. So it is two slots better. I was under the impression... I've always heard you could have it be one or two slots better. We can't tear that down, can we? No. I always heard you can have it be one or two slots better. But I've never seen two. But this is the first one. So we got an 18 slot multi-tool right here. Nailed the ACDK. We stopped. We'll go ahead and accept that bad boy. And now we have another... Why do they have red and yellow? We're red. Why do we have Christmas ones, man? We got another Christmas multi-tool. So, 18-slot multi-tool. But we did it. We did it. We got one more, one multi-tool better. Um, is there a transmission deal scanner here? I don't think there is one. Wait. Yeah, there is one right over here. All right. So, we're going to scan again. Look for another beacon. Look for another Lance advanced life form. We're going to do this again. I'm going to see if in one sitting tonight... I'm going to see how long it takes us. But I'm going to see if I can get the 24. We only need... I mean, if we found... 20, 22, 24. If we found three more, there's a transmission tower detected. That's not what we want. If we found three more that are plus two, that's all it would take. But I don't think that that's going to be the case. So let me see here real quick. Uh, I think we need to make more bypass chips. Go Make it. We might as well just make a couple. All right. So scan for transmissions a few more times. Look for some more beacons, some more advanced life forms. And then we'll be our beast peeps. And we're back. We just landed. New advanced life form station. Let's see what's going on. Hey there, buddy. How are you today? Toxicity levels are stabilizing. That's good. Ooh, it's not red and green. It's yellow and blue. It's close. If it was blue and white, I'd be certainly... Wait, it's called the certain inversion one. Is that good? Is the certain inversion good? I don't know. But if it was blue and white, I'd be totally down. Let's see here. Check it out. 20 slots. Nailed the AC can't be stopped. So we can just compare. It's only 140 grand. And Oh, wait. Well, hold on a second there, ladies and gentle peeps. Let's go ahead and head over into our guy. We got all these new technologies in it. Let's tear these guys down, just like we did with the ship. Get all the materials back for them all. Before we do our transfer. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> and there we go. All right, sweet. So now we got it. Now we can do our transfer. Now we got... Oh, it costs less now? That doesn't really make any sense. Except... Nailed it, Ace. It can't be stopped. We got a 20-slot tool. Only two more to go if it keeps up with the two. Also, uh, the, the plus two every time. Also, that's cool. The readout on this thing is really cool. So you can actually see. I don't remember if they... I don't, I don't ever remember seeing anything like this before. It might have been on the old multi-tools, but I never noticed it. But this guy, you can actually see how much ammo you've got. That's awesome. And you can also see whether it's in attack mode or it's in mining mode. I really like that, man. That's awesome. All right, but it's uh, too bad because we're going to have to... Oh, wait. Is there a scanner here? We're going to have to go ahead and get uh, at least two more multi-tools. So we'll head over here. We'll do some more scanning. We'll keep it up, peeps. I'll show you when we get a nice, another nice, good, big, amazing multi-tool. We will be our bees. All right. Let's see here. You got anything for me, buddy? What do we got over here? Ooh, the Reflex Omada Samsung, man. Nah. What? How many slots? 22 slots. We got our next slots. This is it, peeps. We're moving up the slot ladder. We got better slots. Give me all this crap. 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 No one cares. Crap. Give it to me. Reflex almost something. 
Yeah, nailed the days to can't be stopped, and it still has the same deal. It has the same thing on the outside where we can see our damages. We can see if we're in uh, attack mode. We can. See Whoa, this is a trippy place, man. This plant. Whoa, there's a blue butt right there. Oh, there's a storm. There's a storm coming. Scan! What are you? All right. So I thought we might take a moment before we get our ultimate super multi tool to say thank you to some people who gave some cool and amazing kind words of support on Twitter. The first one is Scrimpsonite. The Scrimpsonite system. I mean, it sounds like a shrimp based uh, Samsonite product. I don't even know. Scrimpsonite. Let's just do it. There it is. Thank you so much for leaving a kind comment on Twitter. And then also somebody asked for us to name um, a system, but I think we're going to get a planet after Brayden the dog. Brayden the dog? You have a, your own Brayden the dog planet. And then um, who else was it? Oh, this person had a really funny uh, name on Twitter. Something clever. So the something clever planet. We have a couple of planets from some other systems and there was a couple other people too. Somebody, this person actually said on Twitter, it was the real, was it the real Teddy? Yeah, the real Teddy. They had said Z the real Teddy. We're going with the Teddy. Z the real Teddy. But it was, he said he wanted me to name a planet something. I can't remember what it was, but I did write down his name. So thank you very much. And then also, uh, with faith. There was what somebody called with faith on Twitter that bought a Poik Band t-shirt. So I wanted to say thank you to them as well. So thank you guys all so very much. Just, oh, 13,000 units. Thanks, guys. So we made a little bit of monies. And oh, there's the scanner right over here. So we made a little bit of monies. What the crap is that? And uh, we got some cool support on Twitter. So thank you guys so very much. That thing's amazing. So there's a storm coming in. I'm going to come over here and try to get some scans done before the storm blows us away. So hopefully after this, we will find... Oh, we're full of crap. Uh, you can go away. So hopefully we'll find the 24 slot multi-tool in just a moment. All right. Another advanced life form. Let us see what he has to say. Hey, how are you doing today? My name is Slipgator Scholar Entity Took. You know, there's another way you can actually get increased multi tools from these guys as well. If they will take, like, if they ask you to take your multi tool, they'll give you back a better one, or they normally should. Let me see here. He wants oxide. Uh, let's give him this. This is not going to give us a better multi tool, but let me see here what he gives us. What are you going to give us back, man? Oh, he gave us a new thing, Accelerated Fire Theta, that we don't actually know. That's amazing. We just need three dimensional matrixes. Holy crap, that's expensive. So, all right, let's see here what we got. The Reflex Amutsu. 24 slots now the days that can't be stopped. I can't believe it. This is it. This is our guy. And it's not It's not silly looking either. I like the little leather straps. I'm liking this. I'm picking up what it's putting down. So, we got to go over here. We've got to tear down this bad boy. The level threes really are what we want to tear down. That they're, they're going to give us the best resources back. Let's take that guy. Go like this. Go ahead and compare. Go ahead and switch. Oh, yeah, baby. And it's got the cool readout deal. Oh, you got something for me over here? No, already known. You suck. All right. We got it over here. Let's take it. Let's take it out here and see. Oh, ooh. Let's switch. Ooh. Hmm. Oh, it's got pink lasers. Oh, they deflect. Do, 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 do. That's awesome deflection technology. Who knew? All right. Get a little scan going. Actually, I accidentally, I want to switch back off of Bullcaster. There we go. Mining beam. So we've got to do, oh, it's got a, it's got a green mining beam. I wonder if it's like lightsabers. Like, yeah, what's this? It's telling me there's a resource over here. There's the flat heridium deposit. Interesting. But I wonder if it's like lightsabers where, oh, Christ Knight. Where you have to put different crystals in in order to get different colors. Aw, oh, inventory full. What? So I'm going to go ahead and take a moment. We're going to, by the way, also this planet is one of the first ones I found ever that um, doesn't have any sort of harmful anything. And I don't need life support at all. I haven't found a lot of plants like that. So this is pretty unbelievably amazing. What are you? Are you a thing? Oh, there's the bad guy. Oh, there's a crab man. Oh, it's like a praying mantis man. But you know what? I don't have a scanner in this thing yet. So safety first, safety third. What we got to do. I'm going to get inside of here. Now let's take a look at this bad boy. So it's got the bolt caster. It's got the beam thingy doodlers. It's got a range booster here. I think I want to kind of arrange this a little bit differently. So I think I'm going to tear this apart. I'm going to go ahead and rearrange it. Try to get it as best as I can with the materials that I have. And I'm going to show you guys the finished product. The super multi-tool. And we're back. 
All right, guys. So even with 24 slots, you've got to be a little bit choosy about what you put in there. You can't put everything, which is kind of unfortunate. I almost kind of think that the, the multi-tool needs to have a 36 shot or 36 slots. You guys know how I feel about slots. I love slots. Me and slots, we're like best buds. Wait, what? What the crap was that? Oh, this is the perfect opportunity. What the crap? Try to hit me, man. All right. Seems to be working. So here, let's go ahead and switch over to mining mode. And I'll show you what I've added to the multi-tool here. So I've got the beam coolant sigmas one, two, and three. I've got the beam intensifier sigma or the beam intensifiers. They're not sigmas. The, what sigma, tau, one's theta. But I got the beam coolants one, two, three. Beam intensifiers one, two, three. And then I've got the focuses one, two, three. So let's go ahead and see how mining works with this guy. Oh, yeah, baby. That's pretty fast, man. And look how long it's taking before it overheats. That's amazing. Oh, my God. We could probably almost... I mean, we could just annihilate this whole thing. Are you kidding me? That's crazy. I'm just going to hold on it and see how long it takes. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It still hasn't overheated. It still hasn't overheated. It still hasn't overheated. There it goes. Oh, that's crazy. We just annihilated that entire deposit of, of heridium. Uh... That's, that's unbelievable. That's unbelievably unbelievable. All right. So let's switch over to Boltcaster. Now, uh, I've got a couple of different things in here. Let me show you what I ended up adding. And this is where I couldn't add everything. If I want to add everything for the weapon, I'm going to have to remove, like, the analysis fiber, uh, analysis fiber, the analysis visor, the uh, range boosters, and some other stuff. But I added the impact damage uh, one and two. I added the Boltcaster S. Wait. Yeah, added physical damage upon impact. This is the Boltcaster SM. I added the recoil stabilizer, rapid fire, reload accelerator, uh, another reload accelerator, uh, recoil stabilizer again, and added clip. So it's 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 good. It's it's good. If I wanted to make it better, I'd have to give up some of my mining stuff and things. So we've got to try to find out a thing that we can do a damage test on here. Trying to see. There was some bad guys around a second ago. There's one. All right, let me see here. There you are. Okay, dead. We really need to try it out on a sentinel, but I don't see any around here. There's normally like a sentinel flying around somewhere. It's kind of hard to see. There's so much flotsam and jetsam in the air. I don't see one. Let me see if I can't mine some stuff and get one to come over and bother me a little bit. All right, they're peeved off. Let's do this! Oh, that's pretty quick, man. Oh, yes! This thing is amazing! That is really, really good. And you can make it even more powerful. Honestly, I might take some of the stuff off the um, the mining in order to get the bolt caster to be even better. But this thing is ridiculous. And hold on a second here. Wow, you really get a big clip, too. That's kind of what I wanted to check out. 83 shots... And wait, it's not pink anymore. It's purple. I wonder if that's because of the night. Let's see here. I can't tell if the laser change color or not either. But all right, guys. At the end of the day, we did it. We've got 24 slot multi-tool, 48 slots in our exosuit inventory, and a 48 slot starship. That's it. We've done it. We've got all the slots. We have how many combined slots do we have? 48 and 24 is 72 and another wait 48 and 48 yeah 48 and 48 and 72 it's like a uh, thousand slots i think for maybe two thousand slots i'm not sure how many slots it is oh that ain't gonna work out even a little bit can't use a mining beam i was just trying it out so yeah that's gonna be it for today peeps we got the super multi tool thanks so much for coming to hang out with me make sure if you like the video don't forget to hit the like button to show your support peeps feel free to share and favorite the video as you see fit and may the stuff and things be with you